Hey, let's talk, guys. Hey, let's talk. Today, at least, I have a voice. At least, we can talk about something. Yes, let's talk about something. Though, I'm just lying down. I'm getting up very soon. Soon, I'll be up. But before I come up, let's talk about something in life. In life, guys, you serve because you are willing, but not because you are forced. You cannot serve if you are not willing and i don't think the meaning of the word serve is um, you cannot be commanded you cannot be forced to serve you you do it willingly because when you serve you serve from the inside of your heart but you, if somebody tries to command you to serve then it's not going to be service service is when it comes from your heart and that's why you see we serve in church we serve as volunteers in uh, different places we serve uh, the sick the aged we serve the children we serve everywhere where service is required is i think to me it is supposed to be voluntary so you can only uh, volunteer to serve but you cannot be forced so now I'm talking about this because uh, when somebody says, oh no, you know you don't like serving and it is, it is not good, I think you should also serve in order that for God to bless you. God will bless you even when you have not served because you are a child of God. But it is always very, very good to serve. Always serve because serving somebody is serving God. When serving maybe uh, that orphan, when you serve in an orphanage, you are serving God because you, those, those are children of God. And uh, actually, when it comes to service, it is service to God. Service to God in any way. Only that God will never leave his throne of mercy for you to come and serve him. God has everything. There's nothing you can ever give God. So what you do is you serve people that God has put in your way, and then God will bless you. So service is voluntary. Service is... Uh, something that we, we do in order to earn blessings from God, something comes that comes from the heart. So uh, let it not be that when you serve, you, when you, you, you when somebody forces you to serve, let nobody force you to serve. That's what I mean because service is from the heart, and God rewards service in His own way. So um, it is a family. It is a personal thing, not a family thing. It's a personal thing. You can decide to serve, to earn yourself blessings from God. And you can decide not to serve and stay. And still God is not going to kill you. God still loves you because it has to come from the heart. Otherwise, instead of giving poor service, you had better just not serve. If you have to give poor service, just not serve. But my, my take is that when, when it comes to serving, it should come from the heart. So it is a voluntary place that uh, um, service is required. And uh, even as the church announced that uh, we go and serve, it was a lot like uh, you have to be forced. So somebody speaking to me about service and I say I'm not able to, does not need to condemn me that I'm, I refuse to serve. Because service is free, service is voluntary, and it has to come from the heart. So I'll only serve when I feel like it, but I'll not be put in a position that I'll accept to serve when I'm not willing. So <laughs> I know those that know understand me that service has to come together with the will. The two go hand in hand. Willingness and service. They go hand in hand. So earn yourself a blessing by serving. Do not coerce somebody to serve when they are not willing to. The word service is, is supposed to be voluntary and it has to come from you. You, you. It cannot be forced out of you. So guys, yes, serve God in many ways because God will never leave his throne of seat, the seat of throne to, to come that you serve him personally. But when you serve another, then you serve God. When you serve another, then you serve God. So guys, thank you for listening. I know you know what I mean. And I know that you understand. And that God is going to bless you even as you serve. Bye-bye, guys. Please subscribe to this channel. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.